Hi friends. We've been getting a lot done this morning. No, I'm not going to the bathroom. I'm just <laughs> giving me a face wipe. We have gotten most of us packed up. I'll take you upstairs a little bit later to show you what we've done. Can you shut that door, Ash? Yeah. In here, we have done a ton of laundry and I still have two more loads to do. I've got a load in there, a load in there. We've gotten two loads of whites. I have gotten my beach bag prepped for tomorrow. We're gonna go to the lake tomorrow. You're gonna go to the lake tonight, right? You're doing an activity for church and you're gonna go kayaking. Yeah. Go get that permission form and set it out here so we don't forget it. Where's that? Um, on my desk. Um, and do you want sunglasses? Here, I found these ones in your cinch bag. Do you want your hat for right now? You might want it. Okay. So we've got this kind of stuff prepped. We have this bag packed for the trip. Um, Chelsea got to do up the bag. She's going to have to get sunscreen again. We've got all of our towels but one. I can't find one of them. Cinch bags in case we want to kind of divide up and conquer. I've got some more food. Actually, that food can go into the food box. I'll show you outside. Out here, I've kind of prepped our food box that we're taking. Chips and the hoagies are in this box. And then in this bag, I've got the pancake mix. I'm going to add Ashley's little fruit pouches. And then in here, I have condiments. I have the mustard, mayonnaise, syrup, some tablecloths for the beach. Then we're taking a whole thing of vitamin water, not only for the time we're at the Lake House, but also just is easier to have it. They don't have a Costco where my parents live, where my dad lives. So it's just easier to take it with us. And then this bag, can you actually run inside, Chels? Um, that's gonna be a shoe bag. We're gonna just put all of our shoes in that. I'll show you a bit later what how I'm gonna pack. Um, it's gonna be different this time, just because I have to carry the luggage rack on the car. It's up here, right? I don't even know how to show you on the camera. It's over there. We have to do the luggage rack, but we have to get up and down um, into the luggage rack three times. And it's super annoying to do heavy, heavy suitcases in and out of the luggage rack. So I'm gonna show you how we're gonna do it this time. But right now, I'm gonna try and go and work off all the toxins so I can get rid of whatever's going on with my face and to not feel as bloated as I have been trying to fix my camera as I have been lately so it's a sunny day but we are not going to the beach today Chelsea's gonna go tonight um, but we want to go out and enjoy the sunshine so we're just gonna go on my little trail walk with the two girls Ashley and Chelsea are gonna come with me Kaylee and Jacob went to breakfast even though it is probably one o'clock <laughs> but they're gonna have fun Chelsea's got her little bag packed so we're gonna go and have fun right Chelsea we finally have heat, don't we? Yeah. I'm trying to get this door to lock. The key is in my bag. Okay, got the car locked. Got my little partners. Luckily, it's not in the sun the whole time. Although, I don't mind getting some sunshine, some vitamin D. I did pick this one because it's mostly in the shade. I'll be on more of a trail up in the woods. And they haven't done it yet. Ashley came with me, but we couldn't go up into the trail because you had your scooter, right? Yeah, but I've done it. You've done the trail? Yeah. With who? You. I haven't done full. I haven't done a like. Yeah, you didn't go all the way up. Yeah. Wait, so is it, is it this like is gonna be fun. A little bit of a hill. Yeah, yeah this is a little dog park right here. There's a little dog park right there. I'm driving. You're smiling, just really doing nothing That's the thing I like about you mm. On the highway, it's our way Route 66 and we keep on driving We just do what we wanna do Yeah, no nothing's coming. Stopping for a little water break I can't drink water or else I'll have to pee and Then we have to turn around <laughs> So I'm gonna keep, it's okay, we're gonna turn around here in just a minute. Okay. We're trying to find the car, right? I don't know. It's up here. What do you see, Chels? A car. I wanted to bring him up to the car. Go look at it. Because they come up and teenagers are kind of dumb sometimes. And so they just, or adults. I just tripped over another branch. 
so old, rusted over. See, it's been a long time because it's a really old kind of car. So, there. Now we can go back down. <laughs> this is our like, okay, we'll go back if we see the car. Kind of cool, huh? So when you want a new car when you turn 16, this is what I'm going to get you. <laughs> Trying to what? Oh, I don't know if it will. Yeah, I think it's pretty stuck. Okay, come on. But now they're happy they get to go home. Yay. 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 Oh, grumpy face. Right. <laughs> the kids are like, how many percentage until we're back? One percent. One percent. And actually, uh, Children's Hospital just called me and we scheduled Ashley's pulmonary follow-up to check her lung capacity. I think it's just reactionary asthma because she's all better now that her cold and her allergies are gone. So I'm not worried about having to wait until October. <laughs> That's as soon as they can get her in. I think that's fine though. But you guys did a really good job. Did you have fun? Yeah. Are you lying? Sure. No. <laughs> you had a fun time. Alright. We can literally see the cars. So we're almost there. You did a good job. Thank you for coming with me and keeping me company. I'm tired. <laughs> we made it to 100%. Good job, you guys. Literally made it to the car. 100%. <laughs> All right. I'm kind of a sucker for this limeade, so we came and got another little. But cotton candy and limeade might be really good. You can have a big drink. Yours just looks cute with the green and the pink. It's been a little while. I've edited a video. I'm gonna take Chelsea to the park or to the beach soon. But I want to show you kind of how we're packing this time. These are packing cubes for Kaylee and Abby to use. In fact, I think Abby has already grabbed her bag, so Kaylee can take whatever she wants from that. Then here's all of our packing cubes, all almost all done. These are all Jason's. There's four of them. Yes, we could compress them a whole lot more, but we don't need to. Then these are Chelsea's and Ashley's. This one is Ashley's right here. This is Chelsea's. And then I have mine. I just got out a pair of socks today to go on our walk. And then I've got my two down there. My idea is to have as many packing cubes as we can into duffel bags. In fact, I think, yep, it all fits in here. So I've got my packing cubes and my makeup and my palette in here. And I've got Chelsea and Ashley's two pouches in there. And so this whole bag right there is three people. And then I've got to find another duffel bag for Jason's stuff. I ignore my, ba my bathroom, I haven't cleaned the counter yet. And then I just have my bathroom bag. It just has like my toothbrush, my deodorant, bug spray for the lake. At night, it kind of gets kind of buggy. Um, just lotion, razors, more lotion, toothpaste, just all my bathroom stuff. Um, I leave it out and use it to make sure I have everything that I use on a daily basis. I also have to pack like my medicines and like chapstick and plugs and a brush. So I will do that in the next day or two. Also, here's the cute sheets that we just got from Costco. We are down to like just having a, this sheet as our blanket because it gets pretty hot at night. But they're kind of cute and it kind of, I don't know, I don't really decorate my room. So I figured I might as well add some color with sheets. Okay, so I just need to find one more bag um, to put Jason's stuff in. Interestingly enough, look at that bag. Isn't that cute? I won that when I worked at Wendy's um, way back in college. I did so well and I earned all these like, you know, rewards or whatever and you earn points. And then you could redeem said points for Wendy's merchandise. 
and I was just starting to travel back then with my best friend and so it was kind of fun to uh, win that bag. Okay. Oh, it's hot in my room, you guys. The AC is in the doorway to go out and it just gets stiflingly hot in here. So much so that my coconut water or my coconut, that my coconut oil melts, completely melts. I'm gonna shave my face really quick. So when I get home from taking Chelsea to the lake, I can take a shower and be done for the night and not get hot again. So I'm gonna shave my face. Now I have oil all over my hands, but I'm just trying to like map out where I can put things in the car. For those of you who are new, we're just going on a road trip. We're going down to Southern Idaho, um, rented a house for three days. It's at a lake it's called Bear Lake. It's super fun, we've been doing it for years. I grew up going there every summer and I love it and kids love it. It's like a big part of what we do during the summer. But we're doing three days there and then a hotel the night before and then um, a week at my dad's house. And so the in and out of all of our luggage in our car and our luggage rack is kind of annoying. And so I'm just trying to use duffels and easy in and out of the car. I think I can probably do two carry-ons in the back of our car, but I want to leave it more open because I'm hoping to take like a cooler. Sorry, you're shaking because I'm shaking the table. I'm hoping to take a cooler to take some more fresh food for us to eat. Kaylee wanted blueberries, which I think I'll get two packages of those if I can find them. They've been really difficult to find. Costco hasn't had them except for the organic kind and they're twice as much. So kind of my plan if I feel like it I'll stop off at the store on my way home from the lake and grab all the rest of the stuff we need so I don't have to go to the store tomorrow I really want to just go to the lake tomorrow and just have that be it so okay we're here at the lake this is a different beach this is the beach we used to go to before the other one was built but you're gonna go kayaking here right yep. we got our permission slip to go and right. get her her kayak and her life jacket and then the others of the kids back there turning in their permission forms for church and then you have to do a permission form for um, the actual kayak company that rents them out. I'll show you the beach we used to play at. I don't even think Chelsea really remembers being I over do. here. You came over with your friends when you were like younger. Well, but I remember being here as well with you guys. Yeah. We also didn't show your swimsuit. You want to show them your new swimsuit? Yeah. Look how cute. I love it. Show them the back. I like the straps in the back. She has to create new tan lines now, huh? You say that I'm crazy. It's just the way that I get every time that I am with you. Mm. Your laughter takes me to heaven. I just want to make you repeat it and repeat it again. Yeah, you make the sky so blue. It's complicated with you. Hey, playing songs on the radio. Sing the words that we don't know how. All right. I have been out and about now for an hour and a half or more. I dropped Chelsea off like an hour and a half. Yeah, an hour and a half ago. And then Kaylee um, wanted me to pick her up Cafe Rio and I had a $10 reward on my account. I was like, okay, well, at least it's free. And then I got clear down there to go and get it. And she was like, well, I don't want it now. <laughs> and so I got my own salad and now, which is free, so it's fine. It was like five bucks, I think. But I um, ran into a friend of mine while I was there at Cafe Rio. And I haven't seen her in, oh, it's been a couple years. And I used to do the nativity with her over at our church. If you remember, if you are old school and you've been here for a long time, you know that I've used to do these huge nativity setups with her. But I haven't seen her in a really long time and she didn't know that my mom had passed away and she's my mom's age. And so it just hit home for both of us as I kind of told her what happened. And um, she's just a really good friend of mine and I taught her kids in church when they were little and anyway and so it was just we've been talking and like 
in the line in Cafe Rio and we're like you guys can go ahead and it was just customer after customer and we're sitting there and we're bawling and we're crying as I'm talking about my mom and she was telling me about some of her kids that are struggling and anyway <laughs> so and I'm headed home to give Kaylee the car so she can go get her own Cafe Rio so that her and her friend Veronica can, can go watch the sunset I think Jacob went home or something but then I had to turn right around and go get Chelsea I didn't get any time alone, so I'm just gonna go and sulk over my Cafe Rio salad, and Jason's going for a run. That's what I know so far. I don't know what the other two kids have eaten. My battery is flashing, and I'm waiting for a light. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey, Chelsea, did you have fun? Yeah. Tell them what you did. Oh, well. You had to say goodbye to everyone, huh? Yeah. But you had a good time? You paddle boarded for an hour? Went out to the sandbar, didn't you? Yes. And then he came back and did volleyball and had popsicles. I'm pretty sure my team won. You, you, probably. Yeah. All right, let's go home and get you some more food and shower. Right? Okay. the magic places in the world I've been to this is where my heart is oh you know it's true no matter where I go I'm coming home to you